Hey guys, Godzilla Zachary here. Welcome back to another video. Oh, today we're showcasing the theme area in Lady's Torch Quest. We're showcasing Monument Land. It's full of all kinds of landmarks from across the world. Oh, and yeah, without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. So there's a, a bunch of landmarks here. here. You're in there all, all big and tall. So let's show them off. So this white one right here is the iconic Taj Mahal in India. Hmm. It's really a big building. And so the main center is the mausoleum. And these white things on the corners, they're actually not called towers. They're minarets. It's... If you're wondering how to spell it, Minaret is spelled M-I-N-A-R-E-T-S. Minaret. And I also added in like this little fountain pathway. And I got this building actually inspired from soaring around the world. If you ever rode that ride in Disney, you head to India and the Taj Mahal is one of the areas. This big brick tower here, here is St. Mark's Campanile. Oh, I do apologize if I, I do apologize if I'm pronouncing this wrong, um, but this is actually the big bell tower in Venice. So, yeah, this one was actually made from a tutorial. Well, I had to change it slightly because it was not like identical to the real tower. So yeah, it's actually like this. If the palace is struggling to load. Here's the One World Trade Center, AKA the Freedom Tower. This one is so huge. It was built with ice in the original tutorial, but I use stained glass since I think that's better. And we have, of course, the 9-11 Memorial Fountains over there in the beacon and shining up into the sky. The White House is right here. This building is currently under a renovation. And so I have to finish fixing it up. I'm adding in the wings things to it. East Wing and West Wing. And I'm going to be getting a bit of a lag spike when I get near the Statue of Liberty. So, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. And so, here's this, the next landmark. The iconic Statue of Liberty. She's, of course, the icon of the map. Since this is Lady Liberty's torch quest. <laughs> and this is, of course, the starting area to the map. Oh, it's raining. And it's going to be a thunderstorm. I'll be right back. Uh, I'm back. I just had to turn off the ring because it just started to lag me hor horribly. So anyways, the statue is here. This actually did get a redesign. And originally, she was completely out of diamonds and was a different shape. So I'm going to quickly pull up, up on my Chromebook what, what the statue used to look like originally. Alright, so guys, that's actually what the statue used to look like before. She just looked like the this big, big diamond square thing. And look, look at her now. Oh, she's completely like the real one. And it's so much better. The statue was basically updated to Prismarine. And this little armor stand right here. This is a little old Lady Liberty. I tried to see if she could hold the book, but unfortunately she cannot. Yeah, but it looks really amazing and next to the giant one. Uh, and yeah, so the starting area that uh, Delay Lady Choice Quest is here. This is basically the, a pearl or be recreation in, in ground pixel art of a sun. These are basically all the rules. I'm not going to go over them. Hmm. 
and this is the map itself. This is actually how big Lady Liberty's Torch Quest is. And of course, over here are the flags of the world. These are all the countries that are in Lady Liberty's Torch Quest, uh, including in, in these China, United Kingdom, um, Brazil, Malaysia, the United States, Japan, India, Taiwan. France, the United Arab Emirates, it's Egypt, Canada, Italy, Saudi Arabia, and soon to be Russia and Germany. So that's the starting area and the Statue of Liberty. So yeah. So there's the Chrysler building. Made from a tutorial and is pretty high. Yeah, the London Eye. It's not really much of a landmark, but it is an icon of London. The Eiffel Tower. I just finished this too. Who's? It's because I put it on a, reno a renovation. And there it is. Part of it made from tutorial, the other half redesigned by me. There's the Oriental Pearl Tower. Oh shoot, I didn't mean to take a screenshot, but it's that one right there. It's the tallest tower in this map, and that white statue is Christ the Redeemer. And the big blue one right there is the Taipei 101. We have the Empire State Building. The twin buildings over there are the Patronus Towers. That white unfinished thing right there is going to be the Lean Tower of Pisa. The big white pyramid is the Trans America Pyramid from San Francisco. We have the Burj Al Air from Dubai and the Cinderella Castle from Walt Disney World. Well, it's not really much of a landmark, but it is a Disney World of landmark, so I decided to add it in. Uh, and that pink really shines out against all the buildings. But we have one more landmark to do. There are others, but I'll get those soon. This is the last one in Monument Land. Alright, so the t the best landmark yet in this map. If, if not as good as those Lady Liberty. It is getting dark and you see all the landmarks turning on. But it's this iconic building. The Palace of Westminster and Big Ben. A.K.A. Elizabeth Tower. And for this building, someone asked if I had the tutorial for it. it I currently don't, don't, don't. But I plan to do a little tutorial on this building in the future. Yeah, it's going to be pretty hard to do. Ooh, but I will try my best. Oh, well, yeah. And this house actually has a big story. I built this back in 2017. And it looked a lot more different then. I kept having to change the styles over time. And it wasn't until 2019 that I finally got it right. Like, in May, in March of 2020, I put the building under renovations. It's to make it more realistic in the old style. You did see, if you've seen that video, you'll, you'll be sure to check it out if you've not. Uh, mm, mm, and in, later on in, on in 2020, I refurbished the building again and, and turned it into this. And this is currently the modern palace. Uh, And I just need a gradual point. Like, just show you the size of there. It, it's massive. It's the widest building in the entire map. This is as high as I can be right now, but that's the size of there. There's a couple more landmarks around. Like that blue one right there. Here, 
But that's still in construction. It's going to become the Shanghai Tower. But the last one I think I can show right now. No. Oh, is another clock tower. The Mecha Royal Clock Tower. Oh, you see Disneyland Minecraft right there. There, I'll be doing a showcase on this area later. So I'm having to look, look down a bit to try to get the area to load. So guys, is I gotta make my way to the clock tower and get those area to load in. in, in. And so, I'll be right back real quick. I'm almost at the clock tower, but here's a closer look at Big Ben. And there's the Westminster Hall. Oh, and if you've ever seen like my universe, maybe, like where it originally had like like those townhouses there. I decided to remove them uh, to make way for some fast food restaurants. But there's the Mecca Royal Clock Tower. I'm gonna zoom in on my FOV. So that's the Mecca Royal Clock Tower. Just had to set today so I could show you it. And there's the crescent on top. So this clock tower is the tallest one in the map. Have just surpassed Big Ben. And I recently finished it too. Ooh. That one, not this one. It stretches really high. That one was made from a tutorial too, but I have to finish the inside though. And this map has clock towers everywhere. Besides this one and that, and Big Ben, there's that clock tower house right there. A very distant Halloween clock tower over there. A Christmas clock tower. And a YouTuber clock tower. And the clock tower on Cinderella Castle. And that jungle one over there. But there's a lot more areas to do. Okay. So, let me return my FOV to normal. There we go. I'm just listening to a V. Oh, oh, I won't give it away though. Oh, because I might. Hey, I'm just nervous about copyright claim, but I'm not too sure. Okay. But yeah, guys. Uh, that is just going to basically be. Yeah. Oh, and one more thing that I want to point out about Big Ben is this. Yes, this is actually the first house I have ever built in Minecraft. And it's really amazing. In, in the 2020 redesign, I did have to shrink the size of it. Mm. In floors. The tower is the same height, but uh, just redesigned. Uh, because my goal about redesigning the palace was to keep the structure the same size, but just redesign it. And so Big Ben actually is still as my first clock tower house in Minecraft. But yeah, guys. I do hope you enjoyed this video. Oh, checking out Monument Land and in Lady Liberty's Torch Quest. And if you did enjoy, guys, be sure to leave a like. Hey, 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 subscribe for more or and click the bell to get notified for more videos about Minecraft, Disney, clocks, and Legos. And uh, I'll see you guys next time. Oh, bye.